Dr. Go Hetfield, it's so great to see you. We uh, just recently, in one of our services, introduced you to Jillian, otherwise known as Gillian. <laughs> no. <laughs> Not at all. The Jilly. Not at all. Don't call her Don't call her Gillian. <laughs> Jillian Manili Vanilli. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jillian is our newest teammate here at Dr. Go Hetfield, currently just in a half day position. Um, doing management and administration and tackling some of our ministry processes. But we thought it'd be good just to introduce you guys to Jillian in the most formal way possible, <laughs> asking her random questions that we got from the internet. <laughs> Question number one. Um, Jillian, what did you want to be when you grow up? Sure. I actually wanted to be an artist. Um, yeah, I think I was more in my creative side of things then. Um, I wanted to do, I used to do oil paintings. So yeah, I was actually wanted to go study fine arts at Rhodes University. Wow, nice. So Julie, I've got a question for you. Oh. And this is a defining question. Yes. Cats or dogs? 100% dogs, I'm allergic yes. to cats. That is yes. what we love to hear. There we go. That's what we love to hear, being allergic Hatfield to cats. Hatfield cat people, we love you. <laughs> but let's be serious. Uh, um, if you could live anywhere, except Pretoria, obviously, oh. where would you live? Mm. I can't say exactly, but I can say. My mom has always said, Jillian, once you go overseas, you're not going to come back. So I haven't gone yet. So yeah. still in Pretoria. Um, but I can't say where. But I would love to... Um, I think I'd love to just go to London and see what that's like. Dr. No, London, yeah. guys. London. It's not open to you guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> London's calling. <laughs> sorry, guys, not today. What superhero would you be and why? Uh, not a superhero. I would probably be Little Mermaid. Oh, That's wow. the first thing that came to my mind. <laughs> what oh, what wow. superpower does she have, swim. by the way? I don't know what superpower you have there. <laughs> under, the sea. Can under, swim the sea. under the sea. You can sing. Disney songs <laughs> under the water. Yeah, yeah you, can you can sing without the water going into your mouth. Uh, how would you sum up yourself if you had one sentence to do so? Uh, actually, I would say I'm very blonde. <laughs> <laughs> what else? One sentence. Yeah. Uh, sorry, <laughs> I didn't answer that properly at all. <laughs> I, yeah, I think I'm, I'm blonde, gullible, intelligent, funny. Um, yeah, just love to laugh and have fun, I would say. Nice. The next one on the list is what is Taiki's worst quality as a person? <laughs> That's not I'm on the list. Kidding. It's here, genuinely. Taiki, how did this Taiki, happen? you're famous. <laughs> if you could eat only one food for the rest of your life, what would you choose and why? Spaghetti. What? Yes, I love spaghetti, spaghetti. bolognese with lots of cheese. <laughs> Lots of cheese. Okay, guys, so you've heard it. I'm very simple. Hatfield Just... people, if you want to take Jillian out for a nice dinner, spaghetti with lots of cheese. Yes. So, Jilly, what do you do for fun? What I do for fun, I spend time with friends, I watch movies, I go into nature. Um, I really actually like photography. So yeah, I go into nature, take photos. I'm not saying I'm good at it, I'm saying I enjoy it. <laughs> Dylan, if you think about the future of Dr. Doe Hatfield and your role in it, what's one thing that you maybe are excited about? Um, I'm excited about Mostly the move of the Spirit. I'm excited about um, the manifestation of the Spirit in the church. I'm excited um, yeah, where miracles, signs and wonders will be kept an everyday thing in our lives. Where it isn't something yeah, that we only see on YouTube or at big mm. churches. Mm. It's something that we can see in our everyday. Um, so yeah, I'm very excited nice. about that. Amen. Preach. Jillian, thank you for spending time with us today. Cheers to the Hatfield team and to Doxero Hatfield. Hope you have a beautiful, beautiful day.